Hello, Workers of Faith. Welcome to my channel, Works of Faith, the channel of faith, the channel that reminds you, Workers of Faith, that you have faith, faith that can lead you and transform your life, whether it is small or big, but your faith can work for you and it can work for your own good. So this channel, Workers of Faith, is also about the spiritual tips, law of attraction, and cleansing, spiritual cleansing. Yes, because it is important, Workers of Faith, because we are energetic beings workers of faith our bodies workers of faith is just the vessel of what who we are our bodies workers of faith are surrounded by energy field there is energy field that it is always must be cleansed workers of faith so i'm going to go deeper about that topic here on this video workers of faith please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed please workers of faith and i'm grateful for that in advance and for you my subscribers thank you so much for watching this video and i hope you're going to watch it till the end because it's going to be so helpful workers of faith like i said we are energetic beings we live and connect with people energetically whether we like we know it or not we are connecting with people energetically there is a saying that saying energy attracts energy like attracts like and that is law of attraction and we are living it on our daily basics in our mind emotions and thoughts yes workers of faith so what, what i'm saying here workers of faith for this video i'm going to share and help you with grounding yourself yes workers of faith grounding your energy and it is so easy effective and it works so fast if only workers of faith you do it right and you put your intentions to this okay let me first workers of faith finish what i was saying we are energetic beings we connect energetically sometimes workers of faith we get in around people who affect our energy in a negative way yes workers of faith we get involved we in around people who are vibrating in a lower vibration that is why sometimes when you you just got of them those people when we get home let me just say maybe you come from work or for shopping malls or you were around you were passing by and you just ha have a, a quick chat with someone when you are separating with them you are getting home you feel drained you feel tired you are not feeling grounded within yourself it is like you are all over the place or even maybe workers of faith you can even take their emotions you take the how what they are going through how were they feeling when you were around them and at the end of the day you are not recognizing that those feelings or emotions they are not yours you took them from other people yes workers of faith that is why i'm saying to ground yourself helps you to be in your power helps you to return to self power to tap into your inner power so that you can recognize your true feelings. Let me just say you meet someone and you have a, a quick chat or you were on a queue of some sort of, maybe you were shopping, you, you, someone was behind you or in front of you. Maybe they are going through a health issues. Maybe even their emotions, they are emotionally disturbed or mentally disturbed. We are going to feel it. You are going to feel it if Maybe you are in pain or if you are a sensitive person, you're going to feel it. So if you are not aware, workers of faith, if you don't have that self-awareness, you are going to take that energy and embody it. And that's not what we want. Everyone should live with, with their energy. Everyone should be in with their power. Yes, workers of faith. So after you have felt that, that can affect your life in a negative way, workers of faith. That can disturb your process of life, your creativity, your light, even your confidence, workers of faith. Even you cannot even feel your own emotions or what is God is guiding you to do, right? So that it is not okay. I'm not, I don't want to say good or bad because I'm not judgmental here. I just want you to be in your power, to live with your power. Right, so this video workers of faith is about grounding yourself, grounding your, yourself, feel yourself so that you can live your highest potential life that you deserve. So on 
on grounding yourself like as of faith you have to be intentional like i said at the beginning of this video you need to be have intentions and on this intention like as of faith you have to be aware as to why are you grounding yourself right yes you don't need a reason for you to be grounding yourself you can ground yourself if even if you are feeling grounded it is called embracing your groundness how you feel yes you are just embracing it when you when you do this a, a tip that i'm about to share to your workers of faith you're just embracing your groundness but if you are feeling that workers of faith you are all over the place you are emotional you need first ask yourself go with it why am i feeling this way don't ignore your feelings or emotions or maybe you have negative thoughts you took it outside you took from outside you have negative thoughts you have to know you have to go deep why am i thinking this thought trace it when it has started you may not find it is it came from someone it doesn't matter but one thing that is mattering here is that you are not ignoring how you feel you go you are embracing it you you want to go maybe it's a lesson for you maybe it's something that can help you and that is helping you to connect with yourself with your higher self so you are not ignoring how you feel your thoughts or your emotions you ask yourself why am i feeling this way if there is something that you it it's coming up to the surface write it down trace it wait why did you feel that way with compassion because of faith with compassion not with resistance or controlling it to, to go away without knowing why why you are releasing it so here it is not about releasing it's about grounding yourself coming back to yourself you are going to stand or sit down like me right now because of faith sit down then feel yourself because of faith sense your whole body this is important then you're going to do breath work but this breath work it is not that long the one maybe that you used to know you, you you know you are familiar with like meditation breath work no this one is a quick one it can help you while you are even around people people may not even recognize that you are doing breath work you are grounding yourself you are tuning again into yourself you are not being someone outside of you or being taken away by someone you are with yes because of it so here you are going to maybe you are standing or you are sitting Yes, doesn't matter. Just take a breath. And when you take this breath, because of faith, picture as if your feet, under your feet, there are there is nestles. You are breathing from your under feet. Yes. You are feeling that breath going up your veins, because of faith, coming into your your system and going up your head and let it go do this for several times because of it even for 10 times nobody i don't believe nobody will recognize what you're doing because you can do it elegancy with an elegant because of it you're going to breathe in This is so relaxing because of faith and it is healing. Do this more than five times, more than 10 times. It is for your own good. It is even cleansing your aura and making it big because of faith. And it is going to shine on its color, the way your, you picture your aura, it is which, which color. Maybe you, 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 you think that your aura is gold, white, light, or red, beautiful golden light. Yes, because of faith. So, if you do this, you are calling back your power. You are being in your power. You are not going to be controlled by outside. You are not going to agree to things that you, you want to say no. You are not going to work as of faith. Being dis disrespected. I know if someone is disrespecting you, it's their choice. You can not do anything about it. But for you, work as of faith, you are not going to be offended if someone disrespects you. You are not going to be hurt if someone tries to hurt you. Because remember, if someone is hurting you, you are the one who is getting hurt. Yes, that is defined by you. Right. And you are also going to react to situations. So do this work as of faith. Every day, every time you have a chance, you are going to step into your power. 
you are going to recognize who you are with us of faith. Your, your, your confidence is going to be, you are going to radiate confidence. People will see around you that you are confident. People will see that you are not that person who is being judged or they will judge you. You don't have a control again over those people who judge you, but you are not going to be offended. You are not going to be, they are not going to say it to your face, right? They are not going to say it to your face. It's going to eat them there alone. So do this with us of faith to uplift yourself, to live up for your, in your power and to follow what is within. This will also open your, your guidance from within and it will also help you workers of faith to be intuitive, to hear that voice that is so pure, your higher self to guide you. So this video workers of faith will end here. Please come back to the comments and tell us after doing this, how did you feel and why, how did this change your life? I would really appreciate that workers of faith. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and like this video because I know you have enjoyed it. See you on the next video workers of faith.